Hi, in this quick video, I'm going to show you seven quick tips that will make your Unreal Engine development much easier. Let's get right into it. First one is G. If you press key G on a keyboard, it will disappear all the gizmos and will make your editor look like a game. If you press it again, all your gizmos are back. Second one. If you want to get a variable, you will grab it and get it. If you want to set it, you will grab it and set it. But there are shortcuts for that. If you press Ctrl, you will get a variable and if you press Alt, you will set the variable. This is the third one and we are still in blueprints. If you want to grab a cable, you can do it with Ctrl. Holding a Ctrl will grab a cable and you will replug it to another place. And again, if you press Alt, you can just delete the line even somewhere here with alt you can left mouse button and delete the line number four is that you can copy a blueprint you probably already know this ctrl c but you can paste it as a text file and you can have it somewhere saved and again open it copy it and paste it somewhere else and again there is a website blueprintue.com where you can paste your blueprint and name it whatever you want, create your blueprint and it will create a blueprint you can show to someone. It's pretty neat. Blueprintue.com Number five is searching option. If you select a variable and press right mouse button and find references, it will find references, but only in this blueprint. But if you want to search the whole project, all you need to do is press find in all blueprints. And here you will have not only this first person character, but also other, other variables like Paul, for example. Number six is helpful when you need to send a project to someone. This is our Unreal Engine project folder structure. And when you need to send this, all you need to send is config, content and your project file. You don't need to send anything else and all the other folders like saved for example could be very heavy. So all you need to do is send this, the person will be able to open project fully working. The seventh and the last one is about spawning actor. Let's say you're spawning Paul BP right here, but then you go to Paul BP and you want to add another variable and let's make it public and let's make it expose on spawn. Let's compile this obviously and go to first person character when we spawn it and we don't have this variable here. All you need to do is press right mouse button and refresh nodes. Here we go and here is our variable. Thanks for watching. Please write me in the comments which tips you already knew, which you didn't. And if you want more tips like that, please subscribe. Thanks. See you next time.